What music is that I hear? Today we're going to be talking about whether or not creatine causes hair loss. But before we get started, if you guys are new to the channel, go ahead and subscribe. And if you like the content, go ahead and give us a like. And if you don't like the content, really, let us know in the comment section. I'm also going to be including an article I wrote on the subject in the description box as well as our social media. Now let's get started. Creatine is a substance that is found in your muscle cells. Creatine basically shuttles water into your muscle and makes them expand and look bigger. It's a popular supplement. It also increases strength gains. But one thing that is on everybody's mind is does it increase hair loss gains? Well, let's get into that. So does creatine cause hair loss? Unfortunately, there hasn't been any conclusive studies linking creatine with hair loss per se. But in 2009, the study did show that it raises the conversion rate from testosterone into DHT. For that reason alone, I would not recommend using creatine. I've used it. Um, I can't really say that I noticed any additional hair loss, but I didn't really notice uh, significant gains from it. Uh, certainly not enough to warrant the possibility of hair loss. Uh, I mean, even if the possibility exists, in my opinion, it's just not worth it. Well, that's really all I got for you guys. If you guys are interested in checking out our forum, I will have it in the description box. It's Hair Restoration Network, and also our recommendations are listed in the description box. It's hairtransplantnetwork.com. Guys, our websites are filled with thousands of real patient reviews guys just want to share their story and their journey there's no hype there's no BS it's uh, the website was created by patients for patients all right till next time